Hello, my name is Laura Flick. I'm the owner of You Are Loved Templates, and I create templates for productivity and overall lifestyle, and I'll be showing you how to use the income and expense tracker today. You'll first be greeted with this beautiful instructions page. I do want to mention if you use a format that is the day, month, and year, you want to go to this template instead. Otherwise, the monthly overview and the annual overview won't work. Let's start on the setup page. First, you want to add your currency symbol. So I'm going to put a US dollar symbol. Then you're going to list all your streams of income. Now you'll list all of your expenses. I'll just list these for now. Next, you'll go over to transactions. And this is where you're going to list all of your transactions for the whole year. So it's not a month to month basis. I do eventually want to make an updated template for this with different tabs for different months so it's easier to navigate. But for now, this is where all your transactions go for the whole year. You'll say whether it is income or an expense, what the category is, and the amount. You can add any relevant notes if you need to. Once you put all of the transactions in, you'll be able to go to the month overview, select the month, so it was for May, and it will tell you where your money's going and your cash flow. If you're selecting the month and there's no information popping up, it is most likely because you're not using the correct template with your appropriate date format. So in the other date format, these transactions can be read as January 5th of 2023, therefore you would put January here instead. You can also go over to the annual overview and select when you want the timeline to start. So since I started in May, I'm just going to put May and it'll show it all here. And throughout the year, you'll be able to see your cash flow, both positive and negative. So that's how you use the income and expense tracker. If you have any questions or concerns or something's not working, please email me at etsyyouareloved at gmail.com and I will get back to you. 